This episode of Hydro Show is sponsored by Hydro Mag, the UK's independent hydroponics magazine. While we were at MPK, we noticed some homemade systems, so we asked Thomas to show us how to make them. Now I'm going to show you the MPK hydroponic bubbling system. Here is a fully completed one. As you can see, a lot of air lines at each end, dripper ring, a pot with drilled holes, um, some porous piping and some porous piping in the bottom. And I'll show you that there. Here's the porous grid at the, the, the base of the pot. And if you can see in there, there's also a larger porous grid in the base of the tank. Right, just put that down a second. Here we have the pot, so to speak. As you can see, it's got no holes in it, apart from these two on either end, which is by no means enough. Here is one I prepared earlier though. Somewhat earlier. It takes a long time to drill these holes, so um, have fun. For the base of this pot, we will require one of these. These have to be handmade also by four millimeter T pieces, some four millimeter hosing, and basically lengths of porous piping to make up an air grid, which should fit exactly in the base of the pot. Also, you will need to make a dripper ring system to feed the top of the system. This is done with some six mil piping and some five mil elbows. These need to be preheated with some hot water to actually get them to fit perfectly. Once you've done these, you will also need to complete a larger version of this grid for the base of here, so it will fill the whole base. This will need to be attached firmly using some um, easy fix security stickers. So, once you've completed all of them, which will be some time later, you will have something resembling this. Now, once that's completed, you will need an air pump to pump into the, the porous grids in the base of the pot and the base of the tank. Preferably something pretty large. Um, we'll need an eight-way manifold to connect to, and you will also need a submersible water pump. This will be for the dripper ring. As you can see, it will sit like this. Um, you, ha you also have to punch some holes. I don't know if you can see correctly. There, using a hole punch, right round the ring, and this will actually drip feed into the base. We would use some hydro mist stones, which are very small in size, which give a lot more air pockets inside the pot. With also the additional porous piping in the base of the pot, this is really gonna oxygenate the roots, which is gonna accelerate growth. As well as once the roots begin to form through our many drilled, hand drilled holes in the pot, the roots are then going to begin to dangle into the bubbles. This will then accelerate the growth even further. This plant should be visibly growing before your eyes. This will accelerate any plant's growth with this amount of oxygen stimulated to the roots directly. At MPK Technology in Liverpool, we pride ourselves on providing you with the products you need at the right price. Once more, if the products you want aren't in stock, we'll order them in for you. And if you don't know exactly what you're looking for, we'll happily point you in the right direction. MPK Technology Liverpool, going out of our way to help you grow. Visit www.mpktechnology.co.uk This episode of Hydro Show is sponsored by Hydro Mag, the UK's independent hydroponics magazine.